Welcome back. This is a story that we've been following all summer long. A group in Ballard hopes to save the local pea patch from being sold and developed. Well, tonight, King 5's Kelly Greenberg updates us on their plan to save it. Yay, thank you! Adding to the chaos. of a rainy Sunday in downtown Ballard. And the rain is good for the pea patch as well, so you can't blame the rain. <laughs> People looking to save the Ballard pea patch say this is where they need to be. Pea patch, pea patch. They'd rather be over at the community garden just a mile away, but the land their garden grows on is for sale. Pea patch, pea patch, pea patch. So all summer, they've been working to raise funds to buy it. So far, they've raised $50,000. It's only a fraction of the roughly $2 million they'll need. So we're just kind of having fun, soliciting support, and hoping that more people become aware of what we're up to and up against. The Pea Patch's leadership chair, Cindy Kruger, says there's a plan. In addition to donations, she said they'll apply for King County grant funding, including money from the parks levy, which just passed in August. And we're just really working to understand how those levy funds work, what the matches are, what the time frames are. It's going to be a lot of work moving forward to apply for those monies. But she's confident this will work. She says they've heard from local and state leaders who support the cause. And they have more than 3,000 signatures on a petition to save the garden. It's not just Ballard that cares about this garden, but that it's a citywide push for open green space and preserving livability throughout the city. In Seattle, Callie Greenberg, King 5 News.